Victorian star Amanda Buchanan is preparing for her first offence of the WKA Muay Thai world title she captured with a stunning upset in Japan recently. Although a date is yet to be finalised, Buchanan says defending the title will be even tougher than winning it. And she is training harder than ever to make sure her first offence is a successful one. Twenty-six-year-old Amanda Buchanan may already have one world title to her credit, but she is hungry for at least two more. Um, I want to get a world boxing title as well, and also a kickboxing title. So I've got the Muay Thai. Um, I want to get the other two uh, all at bantamweight weight and maybe upper weight division too. Um, my weight's sort of flexible. <laughs> But because of her reputation as one of the most exciting fighters in the world, Amanda is having difficulty finding opponents. Consequently, she is forced to spend countless hours in the gym, as well as sparring with stronger and heavier men, including top 10 ranked Australian junior welterweight hopeful, Tony Squillace. Yeah, it's really hard in Australia. And I'm in contact with the WIBF in America, which is Women's International Boxing Federation. Yeah, there's a few fights happening over there. Amanda's victory in the WKA Muay Thai world title fight in Japan was her sixth win from just nine fights. And two of her three losses have been by split decision. Um, I can't say I like getting hit. I don't think anybody does. It's, I think it's great to be able to get in there and fight um, a full fight and come out with as least injuries as possible. Um, I pride myself on having reasonably good defence. So, it's uh, yeah, basically I try to get in there and not get hit. And if I can do that, well, I'm happy with my uh, fight. Amanda says she will take on any woman in Australia and is even prepared to fight out of her weight division. As a featherweight or lightweight, she has little competition at the moment but understands why her sport does not appeal to all women. You know, you've got to have a mentality to be a fighter. You've got to not mind taking a shot. <laughs> um, so I don't think it is for everybody, the actual competing part, but the training, I think, is, is a great, great thing for everybody. Yeah. Again, congratulations, Amanda, on becoming our latest world champion.